Hey guys, it's Alexei here and I'm going to do a tutorial about how to get someone or something to pick up an object and put it somewhere else. Um, this is a little scene file I prepared. It's, you know, he grabs the ball, picks it up and puts it down. So it's pretty simple stuff, or it ends at like 50, so let's slow down the timeline here. Now, in the timeline, you can see that my main keyframes are on the 10, 20, 30, and 40, and then 50. So we're going to need three nulls. We're going to need a null in the hand, a null where the ball is now, and a null where the ball will be. So let's set up these nulls. First, let's go to where the hand first touches the ball. So frame 10 is where it picks it up. So we need to make a null. And this one should be where the ball is, so put under the ball and press tilde x, which in my case does this command here. Reset PSR, this one. This is the command you run. I have it bound to tilde x, but you can bind it to whatever you want. So this is our position one. Then we need to copy and paste it right now because it's in the right place. This is going to be hand pose. And then we're going to put this hand, this object under the hand object. So we've got this hand controller, which is the one that moves around. And we need to put it under the hand object right now, because this is the relative position that's going to be under here. So now when the hand moves, this now, as you can see, moves with the hand. And then we need to put it where the ball, where the ball will be at the end. But we don't know that yet, so we're going to first bring this part of this animation. So on the object here, let's actually pull this position outside of the object to make sure that it's outside the sphere. Let's go character tags and constraint and click PSR and in PSR let's add another one quickly and let's drag in position one and then drag in this hand position. Now if we turn off the weight on this position one then you'll see that now the ball always follows the hand. And yes, and if we drag it the other way around, we turn this off and turn this off, then you can see that the ball is just where it is at the beginning. So let's keyframe these guys. At the beginning, it's at the position one, and once we get to frame 10, we want this thing to be maxed out, and we want this thing to be zero. And on position nine, we want the opposite. We want this max and this zero. So now that's what we got. We've got the ball being picked up. Awesome. And then it's being put down here, but then it stays in the hand. So on the point where it touches the table, so it's position 40, right now we can see that this actually doesn't really work. So we're going to have to, this is not the right position where I want the ball. So we're going to want to get this hand and move it up a bit and keyframe it again. So now the animation is, he looks at the ball and then he puts it on the table. And he comes back. So at frame 40, we're going to want to add a null to where this ball is. So let's make another null. And let's put it into the object. Press tilde x and call this pause 2. And now here on this PSR tag, we're going to add another one and add pause 2. And we're going to keyframe its weight at 100% on this frame. And this guy's weight at 0% of this frame. And then go back one frame and make this 100%. Keyframe it and this one 0%. And now we have the ball getting picked up and placed on the table and the hand goes back. See? So there it is. This five minute tutorial on how to pick up objects with the PSR tag. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Check out ace5studios.com for more tutorials.